Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. In this video, we have one very interesting system of equations problem. We have to solve for the value of x, y, and z. So let's get started by considering equation numbers first. 1, 2, and 3. Now I will write our first equation and I will take this minus x, y to the LHS. So I can write equation 1 as x, y plus 2 times x plus y equal to 4. Or I can write x, y plus 2x plus 2y equal to 4. Now I will add both sides 4. So I will be writing here plus 4. So I need to write here also plus 4. Now from first two terms I can take x common out. So in bracket there will be y plus 2. From other two terms I will take 2 common. In bracket it will be again y plus 2. Right hand side will become 8. Now y plus 2 is overall common. So I can write our first equation as x plus 2 times y plus 2 equal to 8. And this equation I will call equation number 1. Instead of writing this equation, I will consider x plus 2 times y plus 2 is equal to 8, our first equation. Similarly, I will write our second equation. It is 2 times y plus z. So let me write here 2y plus 2z, this equation, equal to 20 minus yz. Now take this negative yz in LHS. So I will write yz plus 2y plus 2z. And similarly, I will add 4 to LHS. So I will add 4 to RHS also. Now you can see from first two term, y is common. So in bracket, z plus 2 will be there. And from other two terms, I will take 2 common. In bracket, z plus 2 will be there. Right hand side, 20 plus 4, 24. Now again I can write y plus 2 times z plus 2. This will become 24. And this I will call our equation number 2 now. Let us consider third equation also, which is 2 times z plus x is equal to minus 1 minus xz. So I will write xz to the left plus 2z plus 2x equal to negative 1. Again I will add 4 to both sides. So 2z plus 2x. Let us add 4 and let us add 4 to the RHS also. Now from first two term I will take z common in bracket x plus 2. From other two terms I will take 2 common in bracket same x plus 2. Right hand side it will be 3. So I can write here also x plus 2 times z plus 2 equal to 3. And this equation I will call equation number 3. So we have three equations. Let me write here once. Equation number 1, x plus 2 times y plus 2 equal to 8. Equation number 2, y plus 2 times z plus 2 equal to 24. And third equation we have calculated, it was x plus 2 times z plus 2. This was equal to 3. Now I will multiply these three equations. So I will write 1 into 2 into 3. So it will become x plus 2, x plus 2. So we can write here directly x plus 2 whole square, y plus 2 whole square, z plus 2 whole square, 
and right hand side it will become 8 times 24 times 3. So I can write here x plus 2 times y plus 2 times z plus 2 whole square. This will be equal to 8 times 3, 24 times 24. So 24 is square. Now I will consider square root both sides. So x plus 2 times y plus 2 times z plus 2. This will be equal to plus minus 24. And this equation we will consider equation number 4. Now you can see in our equation 1 and equation 4. x plus 2, y plus 2 x plus 2, y plus 2. Once I will divide, it will be left only z plus 2 bracket. So let us divide 1, 2, 3 to the equation 4. So I will write here equation 4 divided by equation 1. So let me write what was equation 4. It was x plus 2 times y plus 2 times z plus 2. Plus minus 24 divided by 1. 1 was x plus 2 times y plus 2 and right hand side was 8. So I need to divide here by 8. Now we can cancel x plus 2 bracket and y plus 2 bracket from numerator and denominator. So it is left only z plus 2. Right hand side will be plus minus 3. Take away 2 from both sides. So z will be equal to minus 2 plus minus 3. Or I can write minus 2 plus 3 and minus 2 minus 3. So we have got 2 z values. 1 and negative 5. Similarly, I will consider equation number 4 divided by equation number 2. Let me write x plus 2 times y plus 2 times z plus 2 times z plus 2 I will divide with equation 2 it will be y plus 2 times z plus 2 and right hand side I will be writing plus minus 24 divided by 24. So from here we can cancel these two brackets. It is left x plus 2 will be equal to plus minus 1. So I can write x is equal to minus 2 plus minus 1. So two values we will get. Let me write here x is equal to minus 2 plus 1 and x is equal to minus 2 minus 1. So here we will have minus 1 and here we will have minus 3. So we have two values of x, two values of z. Now the turn of y variable. So I will write here equation 4 divided by equation 3. Let us do that. x plus 2 times y plus 2 times z plus 2. Right hand side will be plus minus 24. Now turn off equation 3. So z and x variable. I will write z plus 2 times x plus 2. And this value was 3. So I will divide by 3. z plus 2, z plus 2, x plus 2, x plus 2. y plus 2 will be equal to plus minus 8. Or I can write y is equal to minus 2 plus minus 8. Or I can write y is equal to minus 2 plus 8, minus 2 minus 8. So we will get two values of y also, 6 and negative 10. Now our answer is almost ready. Let me write here x was. The two values of x was minus 1, minus 3. y was 6 and negative 10. 
and z was 1 and negative 5. So this is our first triplet and here it is second triplet. So let me write in the triplet ordered x, y, z I will be writing negative 1, 6 and 1 and second triplet will be negative 3, negative 10 and negative 5. So this is our ultimate and final answer. And this brings the end of this video friends. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care of yourself. Bye bye.